This video is about the causes and effects on the environment and human beings of water pollution and the compounds related to this kind of pollution. Water pollution occurs due to any change in biological, chemical, or physical water quality that causes harm to living organisms or makes the water unsuitable for consumption. The most important categories of pollutants are infectious agents, oxygen-demanding waste, inorganic chemical substances, nutrients, radioactive materials, and heat. Infectious agents, such as viruses and bacteria, can cause the transmission of diseases through water and can contaminate water through human and animal waste. Some examples of waterborne diseases are hepatitis A, giardiasis, diarrhea, amebiasis, cholera, leptospirosis, and bacterial dysentery. Organic products such as oil, gasoline, plastics, pesticides, can originate from industries, farms, and gardens and can be harmful to the environment, to human health as well as fish and other animals. Oil spill episodes have already occurred in several parts of the world and are usually considered environmental catastrophes. Most of the human waste present in the seas is made of plastic, such as bags, bottles, and disposable containers. This demonstrates the need to reduce the use of this kind of material. Inorganic products such as heavy metals, like lead and arsenic, can accumulate in the body's cells, causing problems, such as kidney changes, brain damage, and it is suspected that they can also increase the risk of cancer. The most dangerous heavy metals to human health are mercury, arsenic, lead, barium, cadmium, and chromium. The increase in the amount of nitrate and phosphate, which are nutrients, in the aquatic environment, can cause the eutrophication process. During eutrophication, there will be an excessive emergence of organisms such as algae and cyanobacteria. In this process, the water body acquires a cloudy color, making photosynthesis difficult and causing a decrease in oxygen content, and also the death of several species. Oxygen-demanding organic waste, such as sewage and manure, can be decomposed by bacteria in the water body reducing the oxygen content in water bodies harming fish and other living organisms that use oxygen in the aquatic environment. If an oxygen-demanding organic waste is released into the water, the process of self-purification may occur. In this process, there is a restoration of balance in the aquatic environment, by essentially natural mechanisms, after the alterations induced by the wastewater discharges. During this process, organic matter will be oxidized, releasing carbon dioxide, according to the reaction. Organic matter plus oxygen plus bacteria originating carbon dioxide, water, bacteria, and energy. Atmospheric reaeration and photosynthesis will also occur, replenishing the oxygen content in the water, if the wastewater release is not very high. In the photosynthesis reaction, carbon dioxide plus water plus energy luminosity originate organic matter plus oxygen. The knowledge of the self-cleaning phenomenon and the assimilation capacity of rivers may be used to prevent the release of wastewater above what the body of water can support. Sediments can originate from erosive processes and cause a reduction in photosynthesis, due to difficulty in passing light, transporting harmful substances, obstructing and silting up lakes. Thermal pollution can harm aquatic life or cause the death of fish due to rapid temperature changes, which would cause a thermal shock. Furthermore, there may be a reduction in the level of oxygen in the water, which is also harmful to aquatic life. Radioactive materials are pollutants that can cause cancer, birth defects, and genetic mutations if they contaminate water bodies. To minimize water contamination, garbage and sewage collection and treatment must be carried out, reducing the contaminants present, before being released into rivers and seas, and reducing the emission of polluting agents to preserve and protect existing springs, and also economy and rational use of water must be a priority.
If you liked the video, leave a comment, and don't forget to subscribe.